Clash stars Miles Teller as aspiring jazz drummer Andrew Neiman. He attends the self-explained best music school in the whole of the United States. And when you attend this music school as an aspiring jazz drummer, there is one place you would like to be. And that is part of Terence Fletcher's jazz band. Terence Fletcher is the band manager, stroke composer, stroke talent searcher. And he is played here by J.K. Simmons. The character is a narcissistic perfectionist who will go to extreme lengths to get what he wants from his band. What transpires in this movie is a true story of determination and grit. J.K. Simmons' character pushes Miles Teller's character to some extreme lengths to get the perfection that he believes is there. This is a truly inspiring movie and one which I thoroughly enjoyed from start to finish. Miles Teller is awesome as Andrew Neiman and I am not the biggest Miles Teller fan. He is very much hit and miss in the movies I've seen from him. But in this one, he put on a fantastic performance. But let's not beat around the bush here. J.K. Simmons is the highlight of the movie. His role of Terence Fletcher is insane. The lengths he will go to get perfection, to get his artist on his tempo, is pretty extreme. He will not only throw insults, he will also throw instruments and chairs just to trigger the reaction that he wants from the band. This is a well-deserved Academy Award that he won for the performance and it is one of the best performances that I've seen within the last 10 to 20 years. If I could use one word to describe this movie it would be intense. The intensity bought from the two main characters is of the highest degree. But not only that, the movie just feels intense throughout the whole thing. It is a very compact, quick and fast paced movie. There is no filler scenes in this. Every scene that is in the movie pushes the story forward and gives you a greater understanding of the characters and why they are driven to do what they do. If you watch this movie and you are not inspired to work on your dreams, to just put in that extra 10%, then I'm sorry, you're just not going to find drive anywhere else. This is a magnificently well-constructed movie from start to finish. Everything about this movie is top-tier filmmaking. Damien Giselle done an amazing job with the direction. The editing from Tom Cross is just perfection. It allows the movie to be as quick and as fast-paced as it was. And to be honest, alongside J.K. Simmons, Tom Cross thoroughly deserved his Academy Award as well for the editing because he is one of the main reasons the movie was intense as it was. The final 10 minutes of this movie is probably some of the best filmmaking you're ever going to see. It is most certainly the best 10 minutes of movie that I've seen in the last 10 years and is a movie which thoroughly deserves to be acclaimed as much as it is. It is my favourite movie from the year 2014 and I would have expected most people to have seen the movie as of yet. If you haven't though, you need to go check this one out. It is a thoroughly enjoyable movie. It is a hard watch at times because of the intensity. But if you want to be inspired, if you want that extra little spark to get you going because you're having a down day, Whiplash is the way to go. It is a truly magnificent movie and one that I cannot recommend highly enough. So if you haven't seen it, go and check it out. And if you have seen it, fuck it. Watch it again. It's that good. Thank you for watching. Peace out.